I mean, it's an incredibly big honor. And I'm just really happy and, and so grateful that um, it was selected and, and that it's in the main competition. It's a, it's a dream come true. But it's also, I mean, really nerve-wracking sharing it with anyone because it's been your baby for so long and you just love this little, you know, piece of you and you're, it's not yours anymore. You give it away and now it's for other people to, to have and to own. Det er ikke med min gode vilje, at du skal på skole. Nej, far. Det er spil, hvis du spørger mig. Det kommer til at blive godt for dig. Nogen er lavet til det, vi laver, og andre er lavet til noget andet. Om Lise så bliver den eneste af mine piger, jeg har fået sendt der sted. Godt bevarer jeg alle sammen. Well, it was the story, that I read. Um, about nine years ago, and I, I read it right after I had given birth myself, and it just really, really uh, struck me. And I right away knew that this was the film I wanted to make. We needed to create a whole world, and we just started building this world. How do we want it to look? And we were very clear, and we wanted to depict the 1880s. The landscape is definitely, it's, it's a main character in the film i mean it's uh, it's also it's a story about that we are just you know little lost humans in a much bigger universe and world and nature has a big um part in the story as well and i think anyone who's given birth knows that i mean it's the wildest thing that you'll ever experience as for the title uh, in danish it's called if you translate it it's more like you who are in heaven and um, which I feel is a beautiful and maybe more precise title because it's, you know, it's God and it's also the mother and it's, you know, spirituality and hope and... Lisa's relationship to God is a story in itself in it because she starts off being this naive little girl who, you know, she believes in God because everybody believes in God, of course she exists. And throughout the story, I mean, she loses faith in God because how can how can God also do this isn't he supposed to be benevolent it was intense <laughs> I mean it's not a feel-good film and uh, I mean it was it was an amazing experience to feel how the audience were I mean it was so quiet I, mean, I think people were engaged that's the feeling I got it felt like that's the story 